all what you need to know before visiting San Diego. Welcome to another video. If you're watching me for the first time, my name is Adham, I'm a travel content creator. Love to share tips and tricks on how to travel more because everybody deserves to see the world. In this video, I'll be discovering and sharing with you where to stay in San Diego, what activities you should do, and also where to eat. Trust me, after watching this video, you would just have the most amazing vacation in San Diego. Without further ado, let's dive into San Diego and see what it can offer us. First, I want to mention where you should stay in San Diego. I have stayed in its bungalow beach hostel, which is located on the Pacific beach. I made a whole video about the price, the varieties of rooms that they have, the location and the service that they offer. It was amazing. I would really advise you guys to check the video. I would leave the link down below. And also I have a special promo code, which will give you a discount whenever you stay there. It would never expire. So check the link down below. Pillman Park is one of the top attractions that you need to visit in San Diego. It doesn't matter how old you are. It was lots of fun to get on some of these rides and explore the park, varieties of stuff. If you're afraid of heights, that's totally fine. You can ride other stuff and I would recommend you to, to challenge your fear and get on some of the crazy rides that they have. Feel the beat, feel it under me. DJ, 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 turn it up and let me lose control. The park is not expensive at all, compares to all the rides and the services that they offer. But we spent hours in this park playing over and over the rides. If you know me well, you know that my weakness is ice cream. And I got to try Parliament Park famous ice cream that was built since 1999. It took me like literally an hour to finish it, but I did because I told you it's my weakness. Another thing that you need to check out is the weekend market. So Almud, is, is that place like every day or only no, on the weekends? Only on the weekends. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So right. Saturday, Sunday, the busiest two days. Okay, so it's only on the weekends. Yes, sir, it's a swap But it's fun. It's, I, like, I mean, you fun. can get out really like a lot of cool stuff from here. Yep. And also it's not super expensive. Like the stuff is like... I have massage? Massage in here. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> that market was so fun. There's so many varieties of snacks, shops, um, people are selling stuff, and also it's very affordable. Like, I was so surprised by the price of the stuff in that market. It's been way too long, I've been building walls around me. Keep my distance so you never know too much about me. I'm living my best life right now. Let's grab something authentic to eat from Mr. Shawarma, the Mediterranean Grill. like me, I like to go and try some authentic restaurants whatever I go. It's just it builds some unique taste that you get to try different stuff and different dishes. Mr. Shawarma has two branches in San Diego. Guys, I really recommend it to you. Editing the video and putting all the footage together, 
it gave me like my my mouth is watery right now i enjoyed their meals a lot plus their dessert is just unbelievable it's a must to visit in san diego if you want to see something crazy like sea lion, you should stop at La Jolla Underwater Park. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. It's free and you can go there at any time. It's so much fun to take some cool videos and pictures, but don't get too, too, too crazy and get too, too, too close to them because they're not nice. I was crazy that I got that close. The park is so fun, even for kids. There's a lot of activities and fun stuff to do around the park. Uh, also, if you're looking for peace time and just relaxing and chilling and, you know, eating a snack on the grass, it is also a place for that. So put it on your list. San Diego nightlife. If you're that kind of person that loves to party all the time when you travel, then San Diego is for you, especially on the weekends. There's a lot of fun, cool bars, nightclubs around downtown that you can go and have fun. I know you guys got tired of me, but this is the last treat that I'm gonna share with you is Mr. Frosty, which is one of the famous old ice cream shop in San Diego. And it's must to visit. Kind of, I lost my words. I don't know what to say about ice cream because, you know, I don't wanna be annoying, but you get it. Look at that. Just look at the ice cream. Of course, if you're in San Diego, you cannot miss not going to Navy Pier, Harbor View. This area is very well famous in San Diego that you must visit. Lots of history, lots of attractions, and cool places to take pictures and videos. We wanted to do something cool, so my friend who lives in San Diego uh, advised me to take a ferry to Tornado, which is the other side of the Navy Pier. And that's what happens when you have a friend who lives in the same area, because it will give you the exact experience that you want. Coronado was full of shops, cool places, and we walked around. It was really, really fun. And also it was during sunset, so the weather was so amazing. <laughs> We went back and I was kind of ready to work out because I travel a lot so I try to keep my workout and not lose control of you know of it because I eat a lot when I travel so I just want to shout out to coach Emgood uh, for coaching me and helping me to have that wonderful workout it was a little bit tough but I enjoyed it a lot he knows everything about working out so if you want to ask him any question about weight you want to lose weight you want to lift more anything that's related to workout I will leave his an Instagram account down below you can reach out to him and he will definitely help you with that I've been to California many times that was my first time trying in and out burger and that was so amazing so if you guys if you have never tried in and out put it on your list that was it for today's video I hope that I gave you all what you need to know before visiting San Diego then now you have a full itinerary of stuff that I have done so it's my experience and I hope you guys can enjoy your trip. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you can get and receive every travel video that I post on my channel. And see you next video. Salamu alaikum.